Mid 31 year old Calvin Lewis is one of the survivors of that deadly Camp Grooms explosion 13 years ago. He's very frustrated over the entire situation. He lost three of his toes and was badly burnt as he escaped the explosion. Lewis said life for him dealing with his injuries has been downhill. Lewis was declared medically unfit and sent off the job in 2004. He said the Army has offered him $18,000 per month as a pension and $12,000 from the NIS. Lewis said the treatment and the pain he has to endure daily are driving him to the edge. Real frustrating, real frustrating because at times I feel I give up. Chuck life, just give up on life. You understand? At times I feel so. And I really and truly want to do what I got to do. But the strength is there, but then again, when the foot starts body, you can't even move about, you can't even do as you like. You understand? It I'm bugging a lot. And as a young man, nobody looking into me. I feel like if I get trained away, I would never encourage them to join the army or the police force because when they get injured, nobody looking into you. According to Lewis, for two years, between 2004 to 2006, the army withheld his salary after he was allegedly involved in an illegal act. He said the money was eventually paid over to him and he's now wondering if that was his compensation. Lewis was speaking to this newscast outside of his Enmore North home on the east coast of Demerara. To make ends meet, Lewis is into farming and working on horse-drawn cart for hire for his daily bread. He said his passion was always to serve his country, but now he's living with regrets. Um, Tore the green bones on both legs, lose three toes and one, and so on. I got for their suffering all the time, and the bigger ones, them, they're in, in their city and they're enjoying it. You understand? The soldiers them that die, I ain't nowhere for the gift to them. All my rest of squaddies and, and fellow soldiers, everybody comes for the same problem. I get in a problem with my foot on and on and on from the explosion in Camp Gooms, right? And the army, they ain't doing enough for me presently at this time. The four survivors in that deadly Camp Grooms explosion were calling to a meeting with the GDF today. The men were all declared medically unfit. Reporting for Capital News, Royce